Welcome to Fitness Friday. We are excited you are joining us today for Think Big with LSVT Big. This video is brought to you by LSVT Global, where we pride ourselves in innovation in science and integrity in practice. LSVT Big is a physical and occupational therapy program that is supported by many years of scientific research. Today, you will get to experience some of the exercises with Dr. Tammy Hefferon as an introduction to LSVT Big. The LSVT Big Therapy itself is delivered in one hour individual treatment sessions, four days a week for four weeks. It also includes daily home practice and all of the goals and activities are personalized to you. The only thing that you'll need for the exercise session today is a sturdy chair with no arms. So if you're ready, let's get moving, let's get going big. Welcome to your introduction to an LSVT big exercise session. We are very excited to be here. Today, we're gonna to take you through um, a few of the exercises that you would be doing if you entered into the LSVT Big program. You'll see me doing the full uh, maximum daily exercises, and then you'll see my lovely husband who's gonna come in and he'll demonstrate if you need some really seated exercises. So there's levels for all of you, and we're just gonna have some fun today. So a few key things, we're gonna focus on moving big. So everything I want you to do, I want you to think about, you're gonna give a 10 out of 10 effort and so that your body feels so big as you're moving through those things. Today, we're gonna to start with our seated exercises. We're gonna do four repetitions on both sides if there's two sides to things. So what I want you to do is if you're seated in your chair, you're gonna to get to the edge of the chair. What works best is if you have a chair without arms. So you're gonna sit nice and big. Then you're gonna take your hands and you're gonna reach forward, go down to the floor, up to the ceiling, and then we're gonna go out nice and big. If you look at my hands, I want you to do the same thing. My fingers are nice and spread out, and we're gonna hold that for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, and back big. Good, let's do that again. Ready, reach big. Down to the floor, up to the ceiling, out nice and big. Let's see those hands. Get them as big as you can. If your posture's a little bit small, let's go nice and big. Here we go, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, and finish big. So I want you to check yourself. Are you doing that 10 out of 10 effort with me? Okay, let's give it another try. Here we go, reach big. Down to the floor, up to the ceiling, up, reach nice and big, nice and big, good. Out to the side. How about those hands, check them out. Get that posture nice and big. Okay, this time I want you to smile and count with me if you can. Here we go, one, two, three, four, big effort, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, and finish big. Okay, one more, you guys are doing wonderful. Here we go, reach big, down to the floor, up to the ceiling, out to the side, really big, reach those hands, you got it. Here we go, nice big smile, it'll help everything, I promise. Ready, nice big smile, one, two, three, four, five, big effort, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, and finish big. Here we go, next exercise. What we're gonna do is we're gonna move our body all the way to the side. So I want you to make sure you've got some room on the side. You're gonna always start big to be big. Remember, we're thinking about amplitude and giving that 10 out of 10 effort. So our body starts to realize that this is how it should move and it makes moving pr very easy as you go through your life as we start to practice this. Okay, so we're gonna sit nice and big. We're gonna start big with that hand, then you're gonna reach all the way across. See how my hand is up towards the ceiling? You can put your hand on the chair or put it on your leg. What I want you to do is reach everything nice and big, and same thing, we're gonna count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and come back 
nice and big. Let's do that again. Out big, all the way across. See how I turn my hand? I want you to try the same thing and really push through that back leg. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, you got it, eight, nine, ten, and back big. Okay, check yourself. How much effort is that? Can you give me a little more? Good, I think so. Here we go, ready? Out big, all the way across, really push big, big, big. Good, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and really come back nice and big. Woo, here we go, one more. Ready? Out big, reach across. Okay, here you go, this is where I want you. If you're kind of this way, not quite as big, I want you to give that really big effort, stretch, 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 and let's hold it for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, big reach, three, two, one, back big. Woo, let's do the other side. Okay, so we're gonna do four on the other side. Sit big, we don't wanna start like this because then our movements are gonna be small. Something I want you to think about as you move through your life is that if we start big, and we think big, things are gonna start to be easier. Okay, so here we go, ready? Out, nice and big, just like the other side. Reach all the way across, really think about pushing through that leg. Let's go, one, two, count with me, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and back big. Let's do it again, ready? Out big, all the way across. Push that leg, here we go, one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and back big. Okay, so here's your goal. The next two, I want you to think about getting that arm and that leg back as big as you can. Here we go, nice and big. Out big, all the way across. Can you get bigger with your push up towards the ceiling? Good, let's hold that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Remember what we're working on? Back big. Okay, last one. Here we go. Out big. All the way. Reach, reach, reach. Good. One, two, three. Big with that hand. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and back big. Great job. Now we're gonna move on to the standing exercises. We're gonna do three standing exercises that are going to be in and out. This we're working on your balance, where our weight shifting, all of those things that are so important to maintain in life. So we're gonna to start to work on moving in different planes. That's gonna really help you at home. I have Dr. E, the PT, or my lovely husband, Eric. He is also an LSVT big certified clinician. He's gonna be doing the adaptations of the exercises in seated. So if you're not quite steady and standing, you might wanna choose the seated exercises to maintain your safety throughout all of these. As always, remember, we're striving for amplitude. So nice, big effort throughout all of these. That's gonna really help you move a lot better. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna start. I'm gonna start with my feet just hip width apart. What did we learn in our seated exercises? We have to start big to be big. Hands are nice and ready. We're gonna go forward, out big, and back big. Watch how I lift my leg. Out big, and back big. Good, that's two. Out, and back, that's three. Remember, 10 out of 10 effort. Out big, four, we got two more, ready? Out big, and back, last one. Out big, and back, great. I want you guys to give that same effort on the other side. So let's go ahead and do this leg. You're gonna mirror me. So at home, let's do this leg together. Here we go, out big and back big. Nice big lift of that leg. Out big, back big. Four more, out and back. Out and back, good, two more. Out and back, lots of effort. And back. Awesome. Okay, so that was forward. Now we're gonna go to the side. So we're gonna start with this leg and we're gonna go this direction. So we have to do what? We have to start nice and big with our big posture. We're gonna go this way first. Here we go, ready? We're gonna go out big and back. 
Here's what I want you to think about. Those hands are going to drive a lot of that big effort. So get those fingers really spread apart. Here we go. Out big and back. Four more. Out and back. Lift that leg up. Out and back. Good. One more. Out and back. Woo! Are we having fun yet? I hope so. I think you guys are working really hard at home, so let's keep it up. Let's do this other side. So now we're gonna go this direction. Ready, here we go. Out and back, nice big hands. Out and back, four more. Out, good, three more. Two more, you got it. And last one, nice big effort and back. Woo! Now we're gonna do the step and reach backwards. This one, if, remember, if you need to at any time do the adapted exercises, we are in full support as long as you keep giving that 10 out of 10 effort. So feet are in that same position. I want you to watch me one time and then we'll do it together, okay? So I'm gonna start with my hands out nice and big. I'm gonna take a step back and press my hands back and I'm gonna lift that toe up. So see, it's a big press and then I'm gonna move my hands all the way back to the beginning, okay? Let's try it together. We're gonna start on this leg, okay? So start nice and big, hands and fingers are big. Take a step back and press those hands back. Now, when you come back, I want you to lift that leg nice and big. Good, let's do it again. Start nice and big, press those arms, press them back, nice and big. Awesome, here we go. Step and press and back big. Three more on this side, you can do it. Big effort. Step and press, and back big. Now I want you to see if you can give a big stomp when you come back. Step and press, now stomp that leg. Awesome, last one. Step and press, and back big. Woo, we got one more side, we can do it. And then we have a couple more exercises. Here we go, we're gonna start nice and big with those hands, and we're gonna step back and press, and back to the middle, really good. Let's do it again. Step and press, and back big. Remember, let's hear that big stomp on that leg when we come back. Start with those hands nice and big. Step and press, and back big. Three more, we can do it. Step and press, and back big. Two more. Step and press, and back big. Last one, big effort. Step and press, and back big. Amazing job. We're gonna move on to do our two rocking exercises. These are really important because when we're walking and we're moving through life, using momentum and speed and amplitude really help move more normal. So that is the goal. Instead of the slow, small movements, we want these nice, big, efficient movements. So we're gonna work on that together. We're gonna do, uh, all, as always, Dr. E, my husband Eric is gonna do the adapted. So if you need to, if you need to do them in seated, 100% okay, he, you're just gonna follow along with him. Okay, so we're gonna all do the same side. We have to start big to be big. Good, we're gonna start with this leg. So you're gonna take a nice big step forward. And then with this arm, I want you to reach way up. So see how I'm on my back heel? And then you're gonna rock back behind you. And then we're gonna reach way up and way back. Good, let's do it. Really reach, really reach. Now we're gonna move a little bit more quickly. So we're gonna get into it. We're gonna go one, two, three. We're gonna do six, four, five, six. Awesome, doesn't that feel really good? Now bring that foot now back nice and big. Let's do the other side. So same thing, you're gonna take that nice big step forward on that heel on the, or on that toe on the back leg. With this hand, drive it way up. Don't forget those big hands. So you're gonna keep that nice and big and you're gonna rock back. And then you're gonna drive that hand way high and the hand way, way high and way back on that side. So really big reach, really big rock. Here we go, one, we're gonna do six, two, three, get into it. Four, five, and six. Now bring that leg back nice and big. Awesome. Okay, now we're gonna do side to side. This
this time you're gonna take a nice big stance. We're gonna do a twist. So you're gonna twist all the way around. So we're gonna go this direction first. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna start big. We're gonna twist all the way around. If you can, you're gonna look at that back hand and then you're gonna come back to the middle. Great, let's do it again. Nice big twist. Look at that back hand. Palms are up towards the ceiling. Back to the middle. Let's do four more. Here we go. Ready, reach big and back big. Three more. Reach big and back big. Try to turn those palms up toward the ceiling if you can, if you have that range. Reach big, there you go, and back big. Last one on this side. Give us all the effort you can. Reach big and back big. Woo, that's a lot of effort, isn't it? Let's do the one to the other side. So same stance, get your stance nice and big. We have to get that posture. So if we're here, let's work on that posture. Stand nice and big. Let's go to the other side. Ready? Reach big. Good, turn those palms up towards the ceiling. And then back big. I caught him cheating a little bit, huh? Ready? Reach big. Look to that back hand if you can. And back big. Let's do four more, you can do it. Ready, reach. And back, three more, lots of effort, reach. And back, two more, let's do it. Nice big twist, and back to the middle. Last one, nice big twist, and back to the middle. What a great job. Remember that effort is really what's gonna help you move better, so think big and move big. do a sit to stand together. We're gonna have two variations for you. I'm gonna demonstrate the first one where you're not actually gonna stand all the way up. So if you have a front wheeled walker or if you, if you have something, maybe you can have another chair in front of you. So if you're not able to stand up independently and safely, this is what I want you to do. I want you to start nice and big. And then I want you to kind of really load into it. And I just want you to practice reaching forward and then sitting back again reaching forward and sitting back again, okay? For those that can stand all the way up safely, we're gonna do this together. So we're gonna reach big and stand big. And then we're gonna sit back down nice and big, okay? Let's do that four more times. Reach and stand. So we're ready to go and then sit nice and big. Good, let's do that again. Reach and stand and then let's sit all the way back down. Really good, let's do two more together. Reach big and stand up nice and big. Good, and then all the way back down. One more. Reach and stand nice and big, and then sit all the way back down. Wonderful, I don't want you to lose that posture, so keep that posture nice and big. We're gonna practice what's called a hierarchy test. So these are things that are really important to you. This would be a big part of your LSVT big session. This is something we know that's really common for a lot of people is getting in and out of the car, having trouble with that. So we're gonna practice a few components of that. What I want you to do is I want you to think we're gonna lift that leg nice and big, just like we were getting out of the car. So follow me, we're gonna do this leg. So we're gonna get it all the way out there nice and big. I want you to have that nice big posture, lots of effort. Bring that leg back nice and big. Good, let's do that again. Out nice and big, and then bring that leg back nice and big. Let's do three more. Ready? Big lift of that leg, back nice and big. I think you can do a little bit more effort. Let's do two more. Really big, good, and back big. Now get that whole body into it. Ready? All the way out, and then all the way back. Great, let's do the other side, okay? So maybe if you need to move over, go ahead and move over. Let's do this leg. So we're gonna reach out nice and big, and then bring that leg back. Good, let's do four more. Out nice and big, good. Bring that leg back. Can you give a little bit more effort to that leg? Ready? Out big, and back big. Two more, get that whole body into it, ready? Out big, like we're ready to get out of the car, and then we're getting back in the car, good. One more, nice and big, and back big. Woo, okay, now here's what we're gonna practice. 
We don't have a door, but we're gonna practice pushing that door open, okay? So what I want you to do is I want you to start nice and big, and you're gonna push that door open and bring that hand back. Good, let's do it again. Push that door open and bring that hat back. One more time on this side. Really push that door open and bring that back. What do you notice? We're using a lot of effort to do things, right? Let's try the other side if we had to open this door. So we open that door big. Good, bring that hand back. Start nice and big, two more. Really push that door open and bring it back. Good, lots of effort, push that door open and bring it back. Awesome, let's practice one more thing, okay? So we're gonna practice putting our seat belt on. So we're gonna start with that nice big posture. We're gonna open that hand, reach up, grab that seat belt, click it in. Good, let's put our hand back on our lap. Ready? So you're gonna start, grab big, and then put that seat belt in, and then end nice and big. Let's do it again. Ready? Reach for that seatbelt, grab it, click it in there, and back to your lap. Let's try the other side, okay? We're gonna go all the way up, grab that seatbelt, click it in there, nice and big. Okay, two more, as big as you can. Really reach, grab it, stick it in that seatbelt, good. Last one, really reach, grab, and stick it in. Notice all of those movements are giving a lot of effort. I want you to think big, even right now, think about your posture. How's your posture doing? Let's keep that effort up. The last thing I wanna help you with today is we're gonna practice how you would implement the, all of the things that we've talked about. Moving big, amplitude, high effort, into helping your walking. So we know that sometimes with walking, it's hard because our steps become small. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna focus on taking big steps. So what I want you to do this first round, I'm gonna to come towards you and walk back away. So you can watch this one time and then we're gonna do two reps together, two sets together. So I want you to think about really big steps, nice big posture, then turn and walk back nice and big. Okay, now let's do that together. So you're gonna start nice and big. I want you to take those big steps. So nice big effort, good, now turn. Keep that effort, really apply it, nice and big, all the way back. Let's try that one more time. I think there's probably a couple of things you can do. Stand nice and big right now. Start that big posture with me. Then I want you to think about pushing through those toes. Push yourself forward. Here we go, ready? Nice big effort. Good, now turn. Nice big effort back. Awesome, I want you to try that around the house today, okay? So really try to implement that big walking. See how much better you feel when you do that. Thank you for your effort today. It's been wonderful. You've been so good and I think I want you to know, getting into an LSVT big program is essential. You're gonna see such good outcomes for yourself. I really want you to take it upon yourself to try it and get in and find a clinician. You can go to lsvtglobal.com and find someone near you. And in this great world, we've learned how to do telehealth. So there might even be some opportunities to do a virtual visit with people. Just remember, our big takeaways from today, move with lots of effort, think big to move better, and just always keep on striving for those movements that are gonna be a big amplitude. Thank you for your time today. Finding LSVT certified therapist is easy. Go to our website at lsvtglobal.com and click the Find LSVT Clinician button. Select either LSVT Big or LSVT Loud, enter your location and search radius, and therapist in your area will, will appear. Discover more about LSVT at lsvtglobal.com. You can email us at info at lsvtglobal.com or call us at any time. Thank you for joining us today.